How's it going everybody? This is Beat the Bush. For those of you that carry a balance on your credit card, you might be interested on how they actually calculate the interest on your credit card. Now in understanding how they actually calculate this, you may be able to exploit this fact and be able to somehow pay less interest. So let's look at how they actually calculate this. Credit card works on a thing called an average daily balance. They check out what your average daily balance for that statement period is, and then they calculate how much interest you owe for that statement period. A point of confusion is that they don't actually do compounded interest as you go throughout the month. So they actually just tally it up at the end of the month only. Let me go through an example because this makes things a lot more clear. For example, on the first statement day, you charge $100 on the first day and you wait 15 days. And on the 16th day, you charge another $100. So your statement balance is actually $200, 100 plus another 100. And you don't do anything for the rest of the statement period. So for this example, let's consider a month where there's only 30 days. In order to calculate the average daily balance, you can actually just go in your credit card and look at what your total balance is for that credit card for that day. And you do this for 30 days, add it all up, and you divide that by 30. That's your average daily balance. But we're gonna do the simple math here instead where we go, okay, 15 days of it will have $100 in it. And the rest of the 15 days of a 30 day month, it's gonna have $200 in it. So we just go do the simple math, 100 times 50, and then another 200 times 15. And then you divide it by 30 to get the average daily balance of $150. You would know kind of on the ballpark if the first half you owe $100, the second half you owe $200, the average of that would be somewhere in between. In this case, it's exactly $150. When you see an APR on your credit card, it's actually something like 15, 18, 22%. That is an annual percentage rate. It's the effective rate at which you'll get charged in the whole year. But when you consider it on a per month basis, this is not exactly what you're gonna get charged. You're not gonna get charged 15% in a single month. So roughly you can divide this by 12 in order to get it, but we want to divide it by 365 days because some days of the month have 28 days, some have 29, some have 30 or 31. So we divide by 365, we get 0.041%. And now in this current month that we're considering has 30 days, so we multiply this by 30, and then we get 1.233%. So if our average daily balance is $100, we can easily do this math in our head that the interest that you owe will be $1.23. Another example, if your average daily balance is $1,000, it would be $12.33. But in this case, it's $150. So we gotta do a little bit more math here. You use a calculator. I don't know how to do this in my head but it ends up to be $1.85 in interest. Why do I even bother with calculating the interest by hand? Is because in doing so, you can see that it's highly dependent on the average daily balance for your credit card on that month. This means that if you do owe something on your credit card and you're paying interest, the earlier you pay your payments, the less interest you have to pay. So for example, you may want to do two payments a month where the first payment is after your first paycheck and you pay some amount, maybe half of it already then you would essentially reduce your average daily balance and in essence, reduce the total interest that you pay. Now, if you happen to get paid weekly or daily, yeah, you can go in there and keep on just paying a little bit at a time, as much as you can every single day if you want, and you're going to effectively reduce your average daily balance a little bit more. This really just says every single day that you have a smaller balance on your credit card, the less interest you have to pay. I hope this helps you understand how a credit card calculates the interest it charges you every single month. Don't forget to check out my Audible link down in the video description below where you can actually get a free audiobook even if you cancel the subscription and you can help benefit this channel. Don't forget to give me a like over here, comment down below, let me know if this video actually helped you save on interest payments. I do have a Patreon link over here where you can directly support this channel and don't forget to subscribe over here. Thanks for watching. Oh yeah, I'm wearing a suit because I just went to a wedding and I thought I'd just keep it on because it looks nice.